News. Breaking news live at five, deciding the fate of an accused killer. I'm Alan Devlin. And I'm Tracy Hutchins. Deliberations just started within the last 10 minutes in the Hannah Payne murder trial. Atlanta News first reporter Chelsea Bonfour outside the Clayton County Courthouse for us. And Chelsea, a major update in this case live at five. Yeah, closing arguments have officially wrapped the jury now in deliberations. The case just handed over to them in about the last 15 minutes. Hannah Payne is facing eight charges, including malice and felony murder. During closing arguments today, Payne's attorney said she is not a killer. She's a young girl who got caught up in the wrong situation. He maintained that Herring is the one who pulled the trigger on the gun that caused his death. The state, however, said it's clear Payne was the only aggressor in the situation and acted with malice when she she chased after Herring, cornered him, and pulled out her gun. They say Payne had no right to do any of that and did not act in self-defense. Do you know how much entitlement you have to have to chase somebody down, detain them, jump out your car, and run toward a stranger? He didn't know her. He didn't know why she was approaching his car and demand that they do anything. This is not some killer. This is not some murder. This is a young girl who got caught up in the wrong situation with a good heart and good intention. Again, the jury is in deliberations. They've only been uh, speaking for about 15 or 20 minutes, so it's unclear if they'll reach a verdict tonight or if this will bleed over into tomorrow morning. Reporting live in Clayton County, Chelsea Vine 4, Atlanta News First.